Alrighty, ladies. Um, I've been working on this huge field with all these round bales. I can't remember exactly how many were made and all that, but I am using the John Deere uh, 560M round baler with custom bales and Cunningham's version of the round baler, his bales along with his bale loader. So as we sit right now, I know these work. If you're having issues with the bale loader, not picking up bales, saying the wrong bale type, more than likely it's the size and everything. You got to get all that sorted out. To begin with, this is what I got going on. This is how we're going to make auto drive and course play work together to grab these round bales and to take them to the sell point or you can take them to an unload point if you set it up with auto drive. So we are going to jump into my Magnum and enable course play. So I have it set up to control D will bring up my course play HUD. Or you can come into this wheel right here with course play. And you can come over here and you click create a job. Now you have bail, collect, wrap. We get rid of the auto drive HUD here. And you guys can see you got your bale types and all that stuff. So right now it's picking up the location of the tractor on the field. You can see it's outlined. So it's going to go through here and hit all that. We're going to hit start job. I got up my cruise control because the mods I got in. But we go ahead, let it start going around and picking up bales. Alright, now that he is almost full, I'm going to show you guys this. You, you can set it up to whatever key you want. I'm going to shut him off for a second. So I can show you. But I have it con to control D in my key bindings. So any vehicle I jump in, control D brings this open. And we have tool offset horizontal. So if I'm not quite getting close enough... Or if tractor's running into the bale, I can move this accordingly. And it's really hard to see, but there's a red line right there that just disappeared. So I bring that back. And that is moving where course play is looking where the trailer's at. So with that being said, you can adjust it on the fly as he's running, try to get him closer and everything. Then you got your bale types, only wrapped, only not wrapped, and all bales. So, like, that's perfect. And the bales left, it kind of calculates that and everything. This is the easy one to do. So, you just boom. We got the same menu as before opened up. It's going to grab everything from this field. I'll show you just like this. You hit go. And once he gets full, he's going to sit here, and I suggest going about it this way because it's kind of easier. So, course play kicked off. And with course play off, now we hit our auto drive, and this is the mode I'm in, which is pick up and deliver. So, it's picking it up from field 8.2. Now, I go into my menu, or... Uh, start menu and into the map here's my point for F8.2 so it's in the field it's off the way and that is set up with auto drive assuming you guys know how to set up auto drive courses you'll be just fine and obviously you pick it from your drop down menu so then I have it set at cell bales which will take it to a cell point so I'm going to click my course play button and I am going to hit go on auto drive. What this course play button does is when it comes back, it will enable course play once it hits field 8.2. Now he's going to run to field 
And I'm going to let them get out of these bales here before I click continue. One other strong point to note is once you click auto drive on, you should be able to see it in the menu. And he found his way best he could, and it's going to come next to the trees, which might cause an issue. And you can see all the jags, but then straight line straight down here. So it did find its way to the uh, point on the field. And he's a little close. Kind of got to watch this every now and again. Usually it's not too bad. And a big note, if you guys haven't seen, Course Play does have an update. And I strongly suggest that you guys are on the latest version of Course Play and the latest version of Auto Drive. I was struggling a little bit and this bale loader was not unloading at the sell points or the unload points that I said by itself. So I'd have to click to it and unload it. But now everything seems to be working a lot better since I've done the updates. And since the game update, I think everything needed to be slightly updated. So now I'm going to click him to go to sell bales. So he's going to redo his point. And it wasn't much different. And now you can see that he jumped right onto my uh, path that I recorded. And he's coming right down here to the bail cell point. So it shows you really good. Alright, we have reached the bail cell point, And it is going to unload them. The way I got it set up is that it's right in the trigger so you guys need to set up your cell point accordingly and you can always adjust your cell point once you have it set down by right clicking on the node and sliding it forwards or backwards accordingly so now we'll let her drive back to the field and she'll take off right away because we have the course play handover enabled once it gets back to field 8.2 all right, we're just reaching my waypoint for auto drive again with the course play handover on and course play HUD up. It should light up and course play will take off. Which it has and you guys can adjust your field speed in the tractor menu of course play. Let's ramp this up a little bit. Be careful on the turns and reversing speeds and all that. But uh, the field is how fast course play will just drive through a field. Field work is how fast it can go. And then we click on the course play menu again. Which now we should be seeing a line eventually. That it's going up and going to find all the round bales. I got some left up here. And the nice part with auto drive, if you get them close enough, I do have another waypoint up in this corner of the field. But it will always find its way back to the waypoint you have set. So therefore, it will work its way out. And you guys can turn and see all your courses. With auto drive, if you hit the button, come into the course play menu, it'll show you them all too, according to where you got them and what you got set up on it. So there you have it. That's how you get the bale loaders to grab your bales, square bales, round bales. You can make them wrap them also. And right now I'm transporting them all to the cell point so they disappear. You use a auto load building they will auto load into the building also and you would not have to move them yourself if you're moving them yourself keep an eye on it because they will run into the stack of bales possibly destroy them all so once again thanks till next time